Create a beautiful landscape filled with attractive, healthy shrubs with just a bit of proper pruning. First, minimize pruning needs by selecting plants suited to the growing conditions and available space. Those tiny plants you buy at the garden center quickly grow to their mature size. Make sure there's enough room for the mature plants. Next, prune with a purpose. Prune to establish a strong framework, remove dead, damaged, or hazardous branches, to increase flowering and fruiting, or to manage the overall size and shape of the plant. Wait a few years for major pruning on newly planted shrubs. The more leaves left on the plant, the more energy produced and a better root system will develop. Do remove damaged or diseased branches as soon as they're discovered. Prune spring flowering shrubs like lilac, forsythia, and bridal respirea right after flowering. That is, if pruning is needed and you want flowers next spring. Summer blooming plants like potentilla and Japanese spirea can be pruned anytime during the dormant season. Gather your pruning equipment. You'll want gloves to protect your hands, safety glasses to protect your eyes, and a few basic tools. A bypass pruner, both blades are sharp and cut like scissors, will be useful for cutting stems about a half inch or less in diameter. A lopper can cut larger branches and extend your reach. A pruning saw or reciprocating saw will take care of the larger branches. Make your cuts above a healthy bud on a slight angle, where a branch joins another branch, or back to the ground on suckering shrubs like forsythia and red twig dogwood. Start by removing any diseased, dead, or damaged branches. Next, remove crossing, rubbing, or inward-facing branches. Now step back and take a look at what's left. Remove a few older stems to the ground on suckering shrubs. Fortunately, red twig dogwoods are color-coded, making it easier for you. The older stems are brown and newer growth bright red. Now shorten any wayward stems for a final shaping. Properly selected and pruned shrubs need much less attention than those that are too big for the location or sheared in shape. Once you prune your first few plants, you'll be more confident and the job will go much faster.